It's football season and I thought it'd be fun to plan a football party so that we can watch the match together. I made a few snacks and a refreshing drink for the party. It was not a big party, it was just a small get together uh, with our favorite people in Kuwait, which is my husband's cousin and their family. So all of them, our kids and their kids love chocolate chip cookies. So I knew that I have to make this. So over here we're making a chocolate chunk cookies. Uh, that's my son who's making it. It's a very simple recipe with just six ingredients. All you have to do is uh, cream, butter and sugar first. And then add egg and the flour and salt. And when license, that's it. Just mix everything together and bake in 180 degree uh, preheated oven for 8 to 12 minutes. Here uh, we've added Galaxy Smooth Milk Chocolate cut into chunks. If you don't have it, you can easily substitute it with chocolate chips. If you're wondering if I've missed out on the baking powder or the baking soda, no, this recipe doesn't uh, require any of those, just these ingredients and you'll get very nice and chewy, uh, soft uh, cookies. My husband is a big fan of my chicken sandwiches and wraps. So he said that I have to include a chicken wrap in the menu. So here I am making chicken shawarma, desi style, which is a very spicy chicken shawarma. For that, I've marinated chicken with all the ingredients that's listed and um, I let it uh, rest uh, in the fridge for about six hours. I then shallow fried the chicken on high flame for about 15 minutes until the chicken was fully cooked and it got charred on the outside like this. Then I took the chicken out and cut it further into smaller pieces. Then to the chicken I added cabbage, chopped onions and chopped jalapenos. You can even add uh, green chilies if you don't have the jalapenos. I then added about uh, two to three tablespoon of Sri Raja chili sauce. If you don't have this, you can use the usual red chili sauce and mix. For that extra flavor, I added chopped parsley leaves and I added red chili flakes and uh, chopped tomatoes. Then I mixed everything together. This sandwich was mainly for the adults because uh, all the other items are mainly for kids. So I made it extra spicy. To make the sharma sauce, I added uh, mayonnaise, yogurt, lemon juice, black pepper, uh, two cloves of garlic, salt to taste, and uh, tahina sauce. If you don't have tahina sauce, you can just add uh, uh, sesame seeds. Then I also added olive oil and blended everything together until I got a smooth sauce. To assemble this wrap, you just have to add the filling in a tortilla wrap and uh, uh, pour the shawarma sauce and wrap it. I do this uh, in the end, the assembly part, uh, and then I also toast the wrap in butter and cut it in half from the middle and serve it. I made hot dog rolls again because my kids loved this so I was sure that uh, my cousin's kids would love it too because they love hot dog and all sorts of uh, recipes that involve bread just like us. So I made this again. And uh, if you want the recipe for this, please check my previous post or I'll just post the link for this in the description box. I also boiled frozen sweet corn for 10 to 15 minutes and uh, cut each of the sweet corn into two and uh, served it. What's a party without chicken nuggets for kids? I bought this chicken nuggets by the brand Nabil. Uh, these are chicken breast uh, coated in tempura batter. I felt this one tastes a lot like the McDonald's uh, chicken nuggets. You can bake this or air fry it or deep fry it. I chose to deep fry because it tastes best obviously when deep fried. I had some frozen beef cutlets in the freezer. I pulled that out and I fried it. 
so that we grown-ups can have it with a nice cup of hot tea. Finally, I made this lemon mint mojitos. Uh, I got these uh, disposable uh, juice glasses and I filled each of it with lemon cubes and uh, mint and I then muddled it up so that the juices gets released. I heard that adding crushed or powdered uh, polo candy or some kind of peppermint candy will give a nice flavor to your mojitos so I added that. Then I added uh, ice cubes, I didn't have many, if I had more I would have filled the glass with ice cubes and then poured 7up. Mashallah, my son was a big help for me throughout the party preparation. Once I finished my cooking, I stepped out of the kitchen and I thought I'll arrange the house for the party. We thought we'll watch the match together in the living room. So I was trying to create more seating spaces. I changed the cushion covers of the sofa cushions and then I just uh, arranged everything uh, and tried to make the sofa look a little uh, presentable and nice. Whenever I have cats coming over at home, I like to spray the cushions and the sofa and the curtains with this uh, linen and uh, room spray which I got from Marks and & Spencers and uh, it makes the house smell beautiful. My daughter was the most excited uh, for the party and uh, she was waiting to wear this uh, Argentina football dress. She calls it the messy dress and uh, she was all set. It was almost time for them to come so I thought I'll arrange the food. I thought I'll uh, place all the food in this uh, big lazy Susan which I got from Ikea. Uh, so it will be easy for everybody to grab uh, whatever they want and I will not have many dishes to wash later on. If you're trying to figure out what that thing is that I'm putting now, it's actually a failed donut. I tried making donut and it failed miserably, so I cut it into small triangles and fried it. So that's it in this video. Hope you liked it. This video is a little different from the usual videos I post. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, please do give this video a thumbs up and comment and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you so much for watching.